सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ डांसिंग एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग हेयर पार्टिकल So firstly guys click on here and select all assets and press delete key yeah and now guys import your 3d character model so i go to import and import fbx file this one and guys i have 3d character model so like this this one and import fbx file like this yeah see guys that's my 3d character model right see okay so guys now you can download this 3d character model from this one that's my mixom website and i have this one that's my dancing 3d character model okay so now stop and guys download this model so download this one yes see guys that's simple process and now again go to blender and guys see that's my frames and increase frame like 1200 yeah and increase like this yeah and go to back and play great right see guys that's my 3d dancing character model and now guys i increase size scale size so scale size this one and increase scale size like 0.05 same yes see guys that's really good simple okay so guys now next one i apply hair dynamic effect on this one character so guys unfold this one layer and select this one structure face this one that's my surface and that's my second one joint right okay so guys select the surface and i go to here particle and click on here yes and guys go to here click on here and advanced check yes great Okay so guys go to so guys length here i like 1 meter this one and segments increase i like 8 is good so source emit from use volume yes simple and now guys go to here dynamic check so guys closer and play yeah that's my here dynamic and now guys i create smooth for animation smooth here so go to here dynamic and quality step is good collision same 5 yeah and structure is good volume yeah good and now guys go to catch a guys i increase frame same 1200 yeah and go to velocity is good rotation and render so guys render b spline path check and step i like Five, yes. And guys, go to viewport display. Guys, standard this one. I like same five. And children, guys, use interpolated. Yeah, good. It's really good. Now, guys, go to back and play. Yes, guys, I increase more for effect. So, guys, display amount I like fifty, and. render amount i like 400 for move here and guys go to clumping and increase clump like 0.1 yes and go to down guys roughness roughness and point i like 0.1 and random same 0.1 yeah that's it guys right so king nothing is good okay so guys go to back and play yeah it's good see guys that's my beautiful hair dynamic so now guys i create material so go to on here material guys material use white color so go to on here white color 
yes it's good so go to on here viewport shading yeah great so play yes okay so guys now that's my first one here dynamic and second one i apply background and second one light so use plane and scale size increase good and guys go to edit mode so press shortcut command tab key and select edge and press e and g so guys increase size this one yeah and select this one edge and i apply bevel effect so use bevel and bevel segments increase yes that's it guys right okay so guys now i apply this time material on background so select this material and create new material and base color guys i like blue color so color code is 0.6 1 and 1 yeah that's it so next one i apply simple area light this one and go to up Guys, I increase this area light size. Size I like four. So go to on here. Size four and power I like fifty. Fifty, yes. So go to up and guys set your camera angle. Select your background closer and go to on here closer. Yes, and take camera. Yeah, and guys, now set your camera angle. So shortcut command is Control Alt Press Zero. Yes, and set camera angle. So select and go to down. Go to little bit back. Yes, and rotation, guys, ninety zero and zero. And guys, again set camera angle little bit down. Yes, yeah, right. Okay, so now. Guys, go to render setting. Use cycle, and guys, go to here, like sixty four. Guys, I like sixty four. Sam, thirty two. Yeah, and device use GPU. Yes, and now guys, for fast rendering, I like thirty two. So I take simple one frame render. So go to back and again play. Yeah, and guys, go to render image. Okay, see guys, that's good. And next one, guys, I apply HDR image and second one collision effect. So close this render. So go to back and guys, select this beta surface and I apply this time collision. So apply collision, simple. That's it. And second one, guys, use. HDR image. So go to environment texture. Guys, open folder. Simple this one. Yes, good. And again, go to back and play. Okay, so stop and go to render frame and image render check. Okay, see guys, that's my beautiful hair simulation. That's my hair. It's really beautiful, right? Okay, so now guys, close this render, and second one I apply this one joint. So guys, see that's my joint. So select this joint, and guys, color I like red color. Red, yes, better. And guys, same apply, same here material. So select and animation. Guys, length I like one. Segments. That's my guys joint. So go to like eight is good. And guys, here dynamic check. And quality is good. Collision same five. Yes. And guys, go to B spline path render. And so go to path and B spline check. And guys, same I like five. So go to here, children, and guys. This time amount like fifty is good, and render amount I like two hundred. Yes. So go to back. Yeah, and again play. 
yeah guys that's take little bit time for rendering preview it's my so much heavy particles so stop and now guys last one i apply i apply same collision effect on this joint effect so joint and go to here and collision check yeah that's it so go to back and again play okay so stop this animation and guys go to camera and i take only one frame yeah see guys that's my final render that's my final render preview is really good my hair simulation is really smooth and now guys close and go to here that's my output guys create new folder so new folder like this and take any file name yeah and guys frame rate third is good and yeah all is good so go to back and render guys use render animation okay so guys that's it my final render preview is finished so if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you